Hey guys, in this video I will showcase our new deck builder app for Soulgate. As we currently have the rank battle event Battle of Shen Tian Di going on, this app should help building and developing decks easier and making it more accessible. So to use the app, first go to the Discord server from Soulgate and go to the channel workshop links. You will find the download link here to the Dropbox. Then you click here to download the app. After finishing the download, it should appear in your download folder and there you can unzip it. And here we have the deck builder app. So it will take some time for the deck builder to load. Depending on the performance of your PC, it should take like 30 to 40 seconds. This is how the deck builder looks like. On the top corner you will find the search bar as well as some filter options. Here you can see all the cards um, currently in the game. On the left side you will have a preview of the card. So if I click one here you will have a preview here. And down below is the world cycle. It is on creation by default. But you can switch it to destruction by pressing this button and switch it back by pressing it again. I will build an earth deck for demonstration. First we will need an emperor so you can press on the card type, select emperor and hit apply to have the app only show the emperors. If you want to add it to your deck just double click it. There you will see that it has added the emperor so here for the Emperor you also have the option to turn the card to see its ascended form and turn it back to look at the normal form. And now we need some units. I will also filter the element by Earth to show all the Earth units. Then I will double click again to add the cards. After adding some cards I can now go to rank and add another filter to have only the rank 2 units showing up. After all is done, I want to add some guards. You can also reset the filter by pressing this button. And then I will filter by trade. Here are the 4 trades in the game. I will go to the guard hit apply and then see that here are my guards that I want to add to my deck. And you can always see a preview of the cards. Then I hit again reset. Here you can also filter by class and also there's an option to filter by effect. So for my earth deck I would want some cards that have the milling effect. I hit apply again and then I will add the cards that have this milling effect. Like so. And this one. So after I have some cards for milling, I can also filter by keywords. So for my earth deck, it would be cool to have cards that have the keyword below, they can activate their effect on when they are in the below. So I hit apply and then see that I have, for example, miss this one, I can add this one to my deck and also this card, which is quite important for my deck and of course this one. So you can see that I have tried to add four cards and then an arrow will pop up saying that I only have three copies of this card. You can always keep track of the size of your deck here in the upper frame. So I have an Emperor and I have 34 cards from 50. 50 is a maximum and you need at least 36 cards for your deck. So next you have the option to filter by speed or HP or even attack. So for this I would like to also have the fox demon so you can use the search bar 
to type in Fox, hit apply, then you will see the other cards that have Fox in their name. So I will add these cards to my deck. And now I'm at 40 cards. So another cool feature is this filter. There you can filter by cards which contain uh, the element that you have checked. So for example, I want to add um, another element to my deck and I want to see what options I have. As I'm playing Earth, it would be wise to have cards that have the element Earth, of course, the metal and water as they are the early elements that I will have in my early and mid game. So I can see what cards have, for example, the metal and water in the gate requirement. I hit apply. Oh, wait, I have of course to delete this, then hit, hit apply again. Then I can see a bunch of cards who has the water and metal combination in their gate requirement. I see a lot of metal cards here. So for example, this card would be a great addition to my deck. So I will add these three. I now see that I have 43 cards, but I really only want to have 40 cards in my deck. So in order to remove cards from your deck, this is the same process as adding. You can just double click on the cards that you, you do not want. So for example, I will remove this card and also this card and this card. So now I have 40 cards again. So I think I'm quite happy with, with the result. In order to really test how um, balanced my deck is, I can use the option test hand this button on the top to automatically draw or generate five random cards that would be simulate my data hand. So I would draw these five cards, which is great. I can now say that I want to draw again to generate five random cards again and again and again, and then see whether my deck is balanced and whether I need to change my deck. So for this, I think I'm happy with the result. So now I hit this button to export my deck and it will automatically open the path, the default path from Tabletop Simulator uh, for the saved objects. So if it's not here in this path, then you have to manually search for it. So for this, I have some, some deck tests already. I will name it Earth Deck Test 4 and save it. Now all that I had to have to do is to go to Tabletop Simulator. So now that I'm in Tabletop Simulator, I can create a room, single player, and then open the workshop file Soulgate's Battlefield. You can find the download link here also at the workshop links and then the second link for the battlefield. So I'll load this. And now you go to objects, to saved objects and then search for your deck. This will be Earth Deck Test 4 and then you will see that this is the deck that we have built with the deck builder app. So hopefully this video was helpful to showcase the deck builder app and how to use it. Should you want to build a new deck, you can just hit the reset button here and it will clear the deck slate in order to allow you to build a new deck. So let's assume that after some playtesting you want to make some improvement to your deck. This you can do by clicking this button, the file button on the top corner and import deck. Then it will lead you to the path where you can then select the deck you want to edit. For this example it will be the Earth Deck Test 4. You will double click it and then you have all the cards in your current deck. You can then remove and add new cards to your deck 
like this. So I'm really excited to see what decks you guys will come up with to dominate the battlefield. And should you have questions, feel free to leave a comment down below or pose a question in the Discord. So that's it from my side. Bye!